Woody Harrelson puts on a superhero suit. That's in tonight's Hollywood wrap. It's all for his new movie, and we are taking you to the premiere. Here's George Pinocchio with that. All right, well, let's go then. Woody Harrelson is set to walk the biggest red carpet of the year on March 7th. That's Oscar Sunday, and he's a nominee. But tonight, Woody walked a small red carpet for his new small budget film, Defendor. When you break the law, you're a punk. In Defendor, Woody Harrelson plays a man with some mental limitations. But when he becomes his alter ego, Defender, Defendor, he feels like a crime fighting superhero. Of course, bullets don't bounce off and he gets beat up. Woody continues to take on roles that now defy being stereotyped. Recently, there's his Oscar nominated work for The Messenger, where he's a military bearer of bad news, and a zombie slaying tough guy in Zombieland. Roles very different from his days tending bar on TV's Cheers. I'm very happy to hear you say that because there was quite a while in my earlier part of my career where I felt like I would only have played one part, you know, so I felt lucky to have an opportunity to get into movies at all. Sandra Oh plays Woody's psychologist in the film. One reason she took the role, to work with Woody. His work in uh, No Country, there's a scene where he and Javier Bardem are sitting face uh, uh, chair to chair. And his work in that scene was so stupendous, I wanted to sit opposite Woody Harrelson. For all the stars of this low-budget film, it was about the material, not the money. In the long run, I feel like really excellent work is, is more important than money. It just it is. I'm sorry. Defender is rated R. It opens on Friday. Mark Michelle. All right. Sounds good. George, thank you.